All right, howdy all. Uh, got some little bass on the shiner. So, you may thought I don't thought that far, but yeah. Um, I was using a small worm hook. Yep, worm hook, and I got a shiner off of it, but and yeah, he's an okay size fish, about a pound. I'll get you guys with my next fish. And bye. All right, guys, got into another bass right over here in this little wooded timber area using live bait again. Yeah, pretty fun. I was using a, another small worm hook. And yeah, he's a little leech at the top of his mouth. Kind of weird again. Oh god, he's gross. And yeah, he's just like sitting right over here somewhere. It's really fun to use. Uh, second fish today. Get y'all later with my next fish. Howdy, y'all. Uh, got into another little, another little bass out here in Ross Lake using a, another shiner. Uh, another dead one. Uh, I was using a dead shiner. It's pretty fun catching them, even the though they're small died. ones. Uh, sorry, my brother's being a little piece of poo right now behind me. Anyway, yeah, I was using a Shiner, like I said, with the uh, same gear, everything, 20 pound uh, Power Pro, uh, Moss Screen Braid, uh, black nickel uh, hook, and you know, just had a dead Shiner floating down towards the bottom, and he hit it. And he's about a pound fish. Get you guys later if I get in my, into another fish. Bye. Alright guys, I got into another bass, using the little shiner right down there on my line. Yeah, as you guys can see, there's a little hook right in his mouth. Just in case you didn't believe me, there's a shiner. Anyway, yeah, I used to, like, my shiner was swimming up at the surface out over here somewhere, and this bass came and hit it. These fish pull hard for a little fish. So she's probably another pounder. Using a black nickel hook, a uh, six and a half foot medium action rod, six uh, high speed reel. It's really fun to use, catch, using live bait. Alright, I'll get you guys with my next fish later. Alright, guys, I got into another bass off a shiner. A bit bigger than the other ones. Same gear, uh, shiner right here. It's a black nickel hook all the way down in his throat. Yeah, <laughs> this, I'm using, and besides, this shiner died already. I used him twice already, and he died already, so. Kind of weird. Anyway, uh, I'll get you guys with my next fish. Uh, bye. Hey okay, guys, howdy y'all. Welcome back. Into a little, little fish. The shiner. Say hello. Hello. All right, anyway. Uh, yeah. He's a small little fish, as you can see, but it's kind of fat. This little female right there. Anyway, get you guys later with my, another fish. Once if I get one. Then this, I might get a catfish too, because it's a little one sitting over there somewhere. Anyway, get you guys a letter, bro. <laughs> Alright guys, got another little uh, bass up a shiner right here. See, you can see he ain't that big. If a dead shiner, like, he's out there somewhere dead now. I cut in half and something, because... Yeah, anyway, so you think he's trying to hook, get him out in there. I was just fishing with the shiners partly bruised and stuff and he hit it off as on the fall. Is that right? I'll really let you go after I'm done video taping, alright? Anyway, let me get a little hold on, let me get a little picture with me and my fish really quick. There we go. Let me just get another one right here. Sure. There we go. Anyway, thanks you guys for watching. Uh Get you guys with my next bat. If I get into another bass, bye. Bro hoof. Alright, guys, I just finished unhooking my bass I just showed you guys. And I'm gonna release him. I'm gonna get some underwater footage, some waterproof camera. Sorry about that. Here we go. guys enjoyed um I'll get you guys in the next uh video in brohoof howdy y'all i got got to another bass off a plastic worm out there flipped it out there using a little darter head it's really cool uh first of all your snack he wasn't doing anything and oh crap there's leeches in his mouth i sure you guys can see that but there's leeches at the top of his mouth yeah it's disgusting that's at least a nice solid two pound bass uh, I'll get y'all later 
when I get to another bass. Uh, all right, howdy y'all, got into another bass right over here in this little weed bed. Super dark in this area over here, so I thought, you just came out nowhere and ate my worm. Um, it's about three pounds, no, two actually. Up oh, more leeches, but. Yeah, it's really fun using live bait and seeing the bass come out of nowhere and eat your bait, but he's no okay no size fish. I'll probably weigh him up and get a picture of it, but see y'all later with the next fish. Bye. A shiner, you can see he's like about a pound. Catch it. Uh, Catch there's another one somewhere, I don't know where he is, but I'll get you guys later if I get to another fish. Uh, it's really funny using live bait. Just my, just my hook, but um, leeches, no, but yeah, occasionally at this lake, uh, basket leeches at the top of their mouth. I think at any lake, also, but I'll get you guys later with my next bass. Bye. Here we all cut into another bass back there somewhere a little bit, and um, yeah, what I realized is this. Fish had a little fly in his mouth, so I guess some guy was fly fishing and he got him. But anyway, I was using his shiner, the size eight hook. Um, I think he ain't that big. He's probably about a pound. I'll get you guys later if I get into another fish. Hope you guys enjoy this video. Um, so bye. All right, how are y'all? Um, fishing Inferno here. Um, be doing a little more fishing at Ross Lake. It's about 6:20 right now. It's like, it's really overcast right now, but yeah, I'm going to be fishing with some shiners, some buzz baits, some, some soft plastics, and pretty sure I'm going to get some fish off the shiners, but I'm also going to be trying like, all these different lures like buzz baits, chatter baits, spinner baits, um, frogs, worms, curly tail worms, any kind of worm, any kind of soft plastic. I'll probably try using some hard baits too, but... Uh, so I'll, yeah. Anyway, let's. I'll get you guys out there when I get when I get there. Alright, he's ready. All right, guys. There's just this giant catfish right here. Oh my goodness! Huh? I just flipped it out there in front of him, and one of them, a dead shiner in front of him. Pull the cord down here. No, I got it. I got it. Get him. Bring him in. Bring get him. In. Get him. Get him. We want to weigh him. that sucker for sure. No, just, no. just get him. He's too big for the net. Just here. I'm. I'm Yes! Oh! Whoa! Yeah! Whoa! Oh, <laughs> yeah. oh my god, you can still use that dead shiner. Oh, where is he though? Oh, Holy right crap, guys, look at this. Where's that the scale? Is a... Do you know what the scale Oh, it's on the backpack. Yep. Geez, that is one big catfish. Do I not get this scale? Oh, wait. Oh, wait. How am I supposed to grab this fish then? How am I supposed to grab this? Yes. Yeah, this your hand too, is it? Alright. Yeah. This shiner, um, it's, uh, you know what? Go weigh him first if you want. Yeah, uh, Do you know how? Him. Yeah. Yeah, just stick it in his lip or what? Is it on his lip? <sighs> just one big catfish. I'm having a heart attack right now. You gotta look for it. Heart attack. Uh, calm down, buddy. Uh, He's. Get it tell. 10, 11, 10, 9. 10, 9. 9. 10, 9. 10, 9. Holy crap. That's gonna stink. This is one big catfish. Okay, how's it? Man. Nice. First cat. Nice first, ugh, stop it. First cat. Alright, guys, here's my 10 pounds, 4 ounce catfish. I don't know. But that's a giant catfish right here, albino. Holy crap, look at that mouth. I can put my hand in there. Holy crap. I am having a heart attack right now, guys. Biggest. Oh, how did you catch that? My biggest catfish I've ever caught in my whole entire life right now. Jeez, look at I can fit the camera down his mouth. Proves how big here, these here, fish are. One, okay? I'll get you guys later with my next bass or fish. Okay, I got to a nice little bass right here. Out here in this little bed over here. It's a nice solid two pound bass. Uh yep, I'll get you guys later with my next fish. Bye bye. Done done. Alright guys, I got to another little bass off Ooh. Oh, right, never mind. I just hooked him through the lip and it came out his other lip, hooked him in the side of the mouth. But, um, I got this little bass off a June bug colored trick worm. It was like all the way right about there when I got him. And, you know, came through the side of the mouth right here and came out. And I was using a spring little thingy. I'm not sure if you could see that, but there's a little spring somewhere. But it's a nice size bass. I was using a one-aught hook with a 12 pound. I mean, 20 pound moss green braid. 
We have a bird with a zoom trick worm and June bug. Catch you guys later. Next fish. Alright, guys. Here's the release. My little fish just caught my trick worm. Okay, sorry, that's just a little satchel thingy. That's the idea. Sorry if it looks bad. Holy shit. I couldn't get that out because I got it. Alright, catch you guys later.